Hey guys, I have another countdown to Christmas. This is Vlogmas Day 10, 11, and 12. And sister and I go shopping and take the boys to go see Santa at Bass Pro. And the girls come over and we make cookies and decorate the tree and some other things. So stay tuned for that. If you're new to my channel, my name is Michelle and this is my Everyday Wife Life. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Hubby's feeding the cats. We miss chow. We miss chow call. Can you do it again? No. <laughs> Camera. All right. I just finished editing my video. Uh, sister just texted me. I think we're gonna go shopping. So I uploaded the Vlogmas days four, five, six. Um, it's chilly this morning. I got my blanket. I don't know what the temperature is. I have to check. Uh, the house needs clean, but I'm going shopping anyway. <laughs> so there's that. Okay, that the house has gotten a little messy. So there will be some cleaning done later or tomorrow or something. So, all right, I'm going to go take a shower. It's chilly. What? It, well, it's 65 inside the house. So what does that tell you? I'm not turning the heat on. And uh, what do I look like this morning? Oh, <laughs> Hey, hot mess. Oh my gosh. All right, time to take a shower. Takes like two, three minutes for the water to get hot from the other end of the house. Don't ask me why it does that. All right, it's terrible. Update on that stain. I'm sure you all were uh, on the, the seat, the edge of your seat waiting for that info. So there's a little bit left. I thought it wasn't going to come out, but it, you can still see it a little bit, but it did come out. So um, I'm going to put that back on the table and the, and the, uh, I can't even think. So I haven't had my coffee yet in the family room. <laughs> I didn't even put a towel in my hair because I want my hair to be curly. That's how you do it. I just got the drips and I'm going to comb it. And it'll look better. <laughs> I promise. I'm actually going to put a little makeup on today. Uh, can I help you, Rue? <laughs> what do you want? You want in that room? Why do you want to go in that room? Why are you chirping? He's chirping. I'm going to go ahead and use this. I uh, liked it the other day. It's not focusing. Why is it not focusing? There we go. So, um, I used it the other day. I like it. So, it didn't make my face feel oily, and my oily face didn't get oily throughout the day. I don't think I washed it just the one time yesterday. Hmm. So, one of you said, I, it, I think it was either Jenny Smith or Jenny Jenkins. I don't know. One of you said that, maybe it wasn't, um, that you have oily skin too, and that you put... Uh, lotion on your face actually prevents it from being oily so um but I have these two and I don't I mean I do put it on so my makeup will adhere to my face um the pressed powder but I it's I don't like it it's it's okay but this I'm gonna start using this so this is a cure brand brightening day cream <music> Put makeup on when you can't see because <laughs> I wear glasses mm. and then my glasses are all fogged up. I need to clean them. I don't even know what I look like. I have the hardest time putting mascara on without getting it all over my face. I just give up and clean it up afterwards. This is all I'm using. This and the Cover Girl uh, Press Foundation. And luminous mascara and an eyebrow pencil and then this elf matte magic mist and set. That's it. That's all I use. If I ever use it. Hardly ever. Oh, I forgot I have this K 
kale that's lux. So they don't make this anymore. I really like it. It tightens the skin, but I don't know. This is working out well. Um, I could use this oil-free multi-cream for oil. Is it a gel? That stuff was a gel, and it worked out really good. So this is Specifica. Is that it? No, it's not a gel. Uh, I'll try that and see how that works, too. But I'm really... I'm really liking this. All right, uh, this is what this is what I'm wearing today. My comfy pants. I still haven't bought some more pair. I need to because uh, it's getting chilly. Um, <laughs> and I don't know. I, just, I don't want to wear my leggings anymore. I guess this is what I want to wear. And um, I want to be comfortable. I have some earrings on. And I just have one ring on. My wedding ring doesn't fit me. Um, yeah, work in progress. It will fit, but it's a little tight. And, then, you know, if I get puffy throughout the day, it, it hurts. And if I wear it on my pinky finger, it will, I'm afraid it'll fall off and don't want to lose that. So, yeah. Anyway, so I can take this sweater off if it gets warm. And, yeah, this is super comfortable. And... I need to find some shoes. I'm going to wear my sneakers so I can be comfortable too. Not hurt my back. My back's feeling fairly good. So, and I'm not going to blow dry my hair because I want it to dry naturally. I'm just going to keep scrunching it. You know, the curly hair thing. I don't have super curly hair, but it will be curly if I keep doing the crunch, scrunchy thing. And I'm going to need a haircut. I haven't wearing makeup in so long. I look different. <laughs> Ready to go. How do I look? Anyway, I feel like that took forever. So, because I did makeup and everything like that. So, I just checked. My sister texted me at 8.15. It's now 9.36. So, an hour and 15 minutes. That's not that long to get ready to go, is it? I have not been doing that. I just throw something on and go to the store real quick in my comfy clothes. Don't have to worry about all the things. I did need a shower though, so there was that. Um, sometimes in the morning if I go to Home Depot, I'll just run in without taking a shower. I don't take a shower every day. But when I need to take a shower, I do. Anyway. <laughs> Alright. So I didn't eat anything. Just a granola bar. Maybe sister will have a banana for me at her house because I have none left. I got my coffee and um, eh, it tastes a little weak. Maybe not. All right, I'm going to go. And of course, on my way home, can you guess where I'm going? Can you take a guess? Home Depot. <laughs> Hubby wants me to pick up a few more things, so I need white paint white exterior paint so we can paint the trim and the ceiling and the porch and i gotta put my seat belt on and um i don't know how much filming i'll do because sister doesn't like to be filmed and i don't like to film when i'm with her i just want to chill and hang out i might well i'll show you a haul if i buy some stuff i'm going to look for possibly another blanket and some a pillow a decorative pillow. Pillows. I don't know. Not a whole lot of stuff. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe a tear tray. Maybe. I don't Looking know. Looking for pillows and I don't see anything that I like. Like that pumpkin I got. One for fall. I see this blanket though and that's I feel like that's a really good price. It is so super soft but you know what? That's like the same exact color of my couch. I need like a contrasting color, but I'm contemplating because this is really nice. It would look really good on the um the little chair in the corner though. I think about it. Twenty five dollars. I think that's I think that's pretty good. It's huge. It looks like it's huge. I might get it. Not the pillows though. They went outside for a minute to meet. The little, the boys' dad, the little dad, because we're picking them up. 
<laughs> apparently today. So, oh, he was dropping off the uh, car seats. So, look at all this stuff is so cute. I'm really into green this year. I feel like I need a table runner for the dog sofa table, but this is way too wide. I don't know. But table runners are a great minimal thing to buy because they fold up nice and stormlessly and don't take up a lot of room and you can make an impact with a table runner. Just saying. Well, we are going into Home Goods next door. Maybe they'll have something as far as pillows go. Oh, that's so cute. Not Christmassy, but I like it. Maybe I should have waited, huh? Look at all these green. I kind of really like the one I got. Because I can use it all year long. And I got a dark one. Anyway. Already. Pillows. Guess it ain't happening. I am stuck in here for the bathroom. Well, they had this at this similar at Bell's for 20 bucks and I didn't buy it. Because I kind of been thinking I don't need it for my bathroom. like four different sets of sheets that I really liked. Um, I kind of really like the Paisley ones at Home Goods, but they were more 50 or $60. The ones at um, Marshall's were only 25. I liked all four of them. They were like green, different patterns that I found. Um, one was a Laura Ashley one. I just went with the $25 one. They're microfiber. Uh, the other one was all cotton. I don't know. Maybe I should have gotten that. But I'm a cheapskate sometimes. And I like to change up my sheets often. So, and, you know, the, the with the well water, they get ruined a little bit. So, I don't want to be changing out white, you know, with white background with a print. I really should go with, like, solid color. But I don't because I like print so what else did I so get? I got these cute little measuring cups that I will put on my tray in the kitchen I wanted something Christmasy but small and so that's that's good and I can change that out and um, some candles and I got two cards one for my sister and one for my cousin she likes gnomes so I don't really do Christmas cards <laughs> So that's it. And then two candles that I won't burn that are for the tablescape. And then that blanket and sheet set. It's in the back seat. I can't reach this, it. We're going to pick up the, the twins from preschool. And then we're going to take them on over to um, Bass Pro. As hubby, if he wanted to go, it's always fun to go in there at Christmas time. He didn't want to. So now we're going to go. We're going to take the boys in there and maybe do a little bit more shopping somewhere else. I'm not sure. Maybe just that. Yeah, pigs. Like 
pigs like mud. Scared me. That scared me too. <laughs> They don't look real, but they are. Get a picture. Go over there and stand. A toy what? Your chimney. Let's see if Monica built one. little baby but <laughs> okay, so that was a fun day so it's now five o'clock hung out here with sister and the boys until Amy come and picked them up actually my sister is a saint so she picks she watches the boys three times a week sometimes she picks them up from preschool because they get out of school earlier than the homeschool co-op whatever you want to call a hybrid thing and by the way, Amy is, I know y'all don't care, but Amy, some of you have been for a really long time, might be curious. So Amy teaches one of the classes. So she's there all day with the kids. It's not like she drops them off and goes home. She's there all day teaching and her, her pay pays for their tuition. So um, then she gets the other four kids, comes here and picks the boys up. Well, my sister makes them dinner. So they're eating dinner now. So she don't have to make dinner because um, they're off to go to church <laughs> tonight. So she makes, I think she makes them dinner every night. So, or three times a week, put it that way. Three nights, the three days that uh, she watches the boys. So anyway, that was fun to take the boys to, um, what's that called? I don't, I, it's on the tip of my tongue, whatever that store is that we went to. What is it called? <laughs> You know what it's called. Anyway, so um, I've been wanting to go there, actually, and hubby didn't want to, so it was fun. They have the nicest Santa there, so take your kids there, your grandkids there to get their photos wet in the middle of the week when there's nobody there. There was no line, and Santa interacted with them a bunch. He photobombed them. I'll put some pictures in here. I'm going to go home and make hubby and I and son some nachos, I think. Okay, so I didn't do the kitchen. I decided to do this. I'm going to do the kitchen in a minute. But, um, yeah, straightened this up. So, to show you what I got at Marshall's and Home Goods, I think this was from Home Goods. It's a Nicole Miller, whatever that means. Blanket, it's not 
I wanted like the dark green, but you know what? This is going to last throughout the year because it matches my decor. Didn't find a pillow. They did not have a pillow I wanted, so this is going to have to make do till now. And maybe I'll find one next year, so it's fine. So, um, I went ahead and put away this other purple pillow because that's my regular decor. And I have the one that I got from Target. Love that. If you're interested, I'll put a link down below. This other one that I had bought a while ago. And then one on the back of the couch over here. Yeah. So I still need to decorate that. I've said that for days. Up there, I want to do some zhuzhing. Um, So I think I'm going to put the ribbon away. <laughs> I think I'm over it. I do use this for the front porch to wrap presents with, to look like wrapped presents for display under the tree. So I'll do that. Um, what else did I get from Marshalls? Oh, something well, I remember. needed a new sheet set. Um, and sister wanted to go to Marshalls. She did too. So she wanted to go to Marshalls and Home Goods. And I really like this print book. It's got butterflies on it and it's green. The right color green that I like for the bedroom that matches my curtains. But after talking to her when we got back to the house, I realized the corners on her are not like I'm not going to like it. Because I have been buying Threshold Target's brand sheets for a couple years now. Five or six. And they don't come off the corners. So I'm afraid these are going to come off the corners. They were only were only $25. So let me put that back in the bag and return it, I think. I don't know. They actually had like a Paisley one. They, this color. They had like... Four or five different sets of sheets that I really liked. And I came down to this one. But I think I'm, I, I should take it back. I do have a spare set. But I don't like it that much. So. But I. So I have. I mean I do. Uh, I don't know. I have. It was the, the fitted sheet that um, ripped. So I have a spare fitted sheet. And then I have two other sets. So anyway. So, that's going to go back. But you know how I am about that. But no, it is going back. It is. It is. It is. Time to nip that in the bud. What is in here that I got from... Oh, I got two candles just for decorative purposes. I don't know if I'm going to use it in there. Uh, in the family room or the dining room. I haven't done the dining room tablescape. And then I got two cards... Uh, one for my cousin. Oh, wait, who is that for? Oh, I guess this was for my sister. And then this is for my cousin because my sister said she likes, um, gnomes. So, she always sends me a card. I'm terrible at cards. Yeah, I'm terrible. What else is in here? Oh, yeah, and then this. I just wanted a little Christmassy something for the kitchen. Uh, I'm not going to do huge amount. Well, <laughs> got this. But I'm talking about that part of the kitchen, which is a mess. Um, I thought I'd switch that out to the measuring cups that I have on my tray over there. My tray that I have all my things that I grab every day. Olive oil, pepper, salt, avocado oil, garlic, all that kind of stuff. So I thought I'd put that on the tray. Um not going to do a huge thing over there anyway so when I took this off that chair in the corner this is going to Amy's and put it in here I think it'll work better in here so there's that and I just I started the laundry so I need to fold that and I need to clean up this mess so I got a target order I don't think it's all here yet so I need to put this away um, I got, went ahead and got these gnomes. I thought they were cute. What is in there, though? Some, they're dirty. All right, and we got a new coffee maker. This is a 12-cup coffee maker, um, from Target. 
I seen it there the other week. Um, we have a six cup, so this will work better. And this is so I can reduce my the cat food plate consumption, the papers. So we got, I got, we use eight a day. We feed the cats twice a day. These are actually kind of big, but that's how they came. They're only 50 cents a piece. So we use, we feed the cats twice a day. So four cats, that's eight. That gives me two days worth of plates in case I don't want to get them washed and no longer buy paper plates and waste that and try to find a bargain on that. And I've been on Amazon to see where, if I could get something cheaper. No, no. I think Walmart is the cheapest, but Publix ones are pretty, are pretty close in price. So I will always end up getting there because I never go to Walmart. So I have to wash these and, um, yeah. I could possibly duel for, um, the patio because I bought those cups for the patio so we don't have glass on the patio and if we need plates for some reason i mean these are kind of small but um we could use those but they are bpa free so we'll see how those work out maybe i'll put my gnomes on the breakfast nook table all right i gotta put this stuff away Shows a few things do a little this and that Laundry, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and I have to go to Home Depot. play with it later. I am not in the mood to do that right now. Good enough. That needs judging <laughs> and put away. My flower basket is overflowing. Okay, time to wash my face. What say you? I mean, got raccoon eyes. Let's do that. So I put this on. Since using this, this is like three different days and maybe not in a row, but I used it. By the way, it smells awesome. It's, it's lime or lemon rather. Um, uh, yeah, my face has not been getting greasy and I haven't had to go back and wash my face a gazillion times. And what is with the bags under my eyes this morning? Oh, they're wicked this morning. I need to go brush my hair. Okay, that's a little better. I need to go put my shapewear on then before my back starts hurting. My back's been good. It hurt like the day after I went to the chiropractor, but that's typical Megan can wicked. What is the word I'm looking for? Megan can vouch for that. That's what I was going to say. Yeah, she always says at the day after going to the chiropractor, she takes a day of rest. I don't necessarily need that, but it takes like two days before I notice a difference. So it feels good. I don't feel a twang in my back or nothing. So good to go. Okay. I, have, I need to clear up this table so I can decorate it. So I have this little manger set, I think. I think I'll put it in the family room. I'm not like ready to decorate in here exactly. I don't know. I feel like I want to be done, but but I don't. <laughs> I don't. I just want somebody to do it for me. How about that? So I think I'm gonna put it right here. So here's the problem. That means I have to put stuff away. And then that, you know, it's a mouse cookie thing. Then there's not enough room in there, I think. So we decided that other room is going, the library is going to be like a game room. 
slash library. So I think I'm going to take all the games out of here and put them in there. And there might be some stuff I can declutter here. But do I want to do that right now? <sighs> I should really was going to save that for Tiny Tidy Tuesday. Mm, I don't know. I'm not going to do anything about that now, but it won't shut. There we go. Um, but I'm just thinking I should probably move that because the cats like to climb behind the TV and stuff. Maybe move it up one shelf where it's not going to be bothered by anybody. Put some twinkle lights up here. So, oh, I wish this lamp worked. I could put that up there. I'm thinking about getting some new lamps. So, if I have some twinkle, I have a ton of twinkle lights here. Here. So. go outside the snow is falling down and every child is having so much fun the snowman is twice the size as me with a smile as quirky as mine we're holding hands to keep each other warm while we stand and watch a quiet perform oh, right now i just cleaned it up i don't know what i'm doing decorating i might have to watch some of my videos to see what i did last year i might um go ahead and put these two reindeer. I think I'm gonna get rid of the other ones. Kind of do a reindeer thing. On this table. Do new. Simple. Put a few more, a few more things. Shows that I, I need to buy a lamp for in here. Maybe two lamps to flank that the either side of the thing. Uh, the the ring light's not working out for me. I don't know what the heck the problem is. I'm using it wrong or something. Anyway, I gotta go check on hubby. He's on the roof painting. I gotta go okay, check on. I didn't even show you what I finished over here. Um, well, I finished that. It looks kind of cute. But I'm not thinking of scrapping the whole thing. <laughs> and putting something simple here. And putting all the reindeer in the dining room. I don't know. But this is cutesy. I don't want the dining room to be cutesy. But that's not cutesy. But that's like one single reindeer that I have. I don't have a matching set. I still have some more stuff in the garage I could pull out. We'll see what is in there eventually. I'm going to sit down and have some coffee. I'm tired. I got to go to Home Depot, so there's that. And I didn't finish the kitchen. <laughs> uh, yeah. All right. So I took a while and was watching Hubby on the, on the roof because he was painting. Did an ingenious thing. I'm like, how are you going to get that bucket up and down? So he touched it to a rope, you know, pulled it up, and then lowered it down anyway. So I got sidetracked with that. So I don't have to go to Home Depot right now because he's done for a while. He got up on the roof. That was exhausting. So I decided to take out another bin of stuff that I didn't realize I had. So... I have to decide what I'm going to keep and stuff. These actually, they kind of smell weird. I'm going to have to spray them with something. They're old. <laughs> um, I guess I'm going to bring that inside 
and go through it. I don't want to, I don't feel like going through it in here. Um, lights tonight, I can put the lights out. We just got uh, those projection lights. Oh, and there's a flag that I can hang up. Um, this is empty, empty because it put it out. Miscellaneous. Not sure what's in there. Uh, there's stuff in there. Just, I don't know that I'm going to get rid of anything else. I was going to reduce. Not happening. Anyway, so. Oh, this is Christmas books. So I'll put those out on the bottom shelf in the entryway. Cut and remove what's there. So. I'm not going to do that right now. It's been two years, and I, two or three years, and I forgot what we had, but I don't want to get rid of it. I'll do little by little. I figure by the time I'm 70, I'll reduce it even more. <laughs> it's fun. Uh, yeah, I might not put it all out next year, but I feel like it this year. And in a while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, So beautiful, kissing on a mistletoe, baby we This situation ridiculousness I need to reduce by half but I'm not doing it now I'll do it after Christmas but it's gonna be reduced I don't know how I accumulated all this potpourri and acorns and pine cones and stuff but I don't need all that as long as I spend this day with you so beautiful kissing on a mistletoe baby with Go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love Yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy You guys are watching Amazing Race. We used to love to watch that one. My son was younger. I think he was like 13 or something. Anyway, I'm taking, I'm watching two, but I'm taking breaks in between and doing laundry or whatever. I got the kitchen almost cleaned up. I'm going to fold some laundry, put in another load of laundry. The girls are supposed to come over for a sleepover. I don't know if that's happening tonight or what, but all right, so I'm going to do that. And keep doing some work, little by little, little. I'm just puttering around the house today. Starting to bloom. Cool. All right. Their guys went their respective ways. Oh, he's actually outside right now, setting up the catio. Well, organizing. We got the shipment for the pet, the catio fence. So he's gonna be working on that. You'll see that on Fix It Friday one of these days. <laughs> oh. So I'm going to fold some laundry, put it away, go make the bed, that kind of thing, and do some more decorating in a little bit. I'm kind of tired. I've been saying that all day, haven't I? I should take a nap. So I helped hubby a little bit with 
opening the boxes, but I saw son just go out there, so that's good. Now he can help him. I'm gonna watch my girl Shannon. I leave a like on a treat. You guys watch her. I just love her. So I'm gonna watch her while I finish up the kitchen, then put away the clothes and uh, make the bed. Do some daily chores. And plug you guys in to make sure so that I'm fully charged. So if I do some decorating later, I have enough battery to film it. <laughs> I'm gonna be to bed now uh, and put the laundry away and I don't know I still haven't gotten a message from Amy as whether she's bringing the girls over sleepover or not I guess it's we're winging it Couple things. Does anyone get annoyed by stuff like this? <laughs> like this. I should pull it off. However, guess what? This comforter quilt goes only one way. So I need to know that that corner is for my side of the bed. <laughs> Otherwise, it doesn't fit right. Because it's obviously the bed's not square. It's actually wider than it is longer anyway two i used to get frustrated with this because you see like i'm not going to sit here and iron that every time so i seen this on denise jordan's channel by the way on the 16th is that saturday d i denise jordan and leona at um what the heck is her channel name i'll put it here I forget when I'm filming what... I know what her channel name is. Um, I just forget when I'm filming. Anyway, so um, we're doing a collab, a cooking collab on the 16th. Um, so watch that. Um, so uh, what else was I going to say? So and then here, I didn't realize this. I learned this from Denise Jordan too. So these are king size pillow pillowcases because it's a king set. Um, but this is a queen pillow and that's, I don't like the king. So I'm like, always was perplexed what to do. Well, you just tuck it inside. <laughs> and I didn't know that all these years you could do that. And my pillowcases are looking yellow. And then this, I'm not going to take it out. That is a neck pillow. I'll put an insert in here of what that is. I've been using it since September uh, yeah, <laughs> if you have neck and back problems, I recommend that highly. I will put a link down to it below. So, you know, for Christmas, buy yourself something nice. And that would be, do some self-care. Buy yourself something like that. Although, I know that uh, Mel from Mel Plain and Simple uh, tried it and she didn't like it. But, I don't know. It worked for me. So, if you have neck issues do that I'm gonna put these two pillows there even though it's almost, <laughs> not almost time for bed it's silly since we're going to I mean what is it five it'll be a while ten o'clock we'll go to bed so for five hours it'll look nice I filled my bubble mug up and I barely drank it I need to sit down and do that I have no clue what I'm making for dinner today might be takeout. We'll see. Grabbed a load of towels. Well, hand towels and wash rags and stuff like that. So I'm gonna fold those. I'm gonna sit out here and trim some of these plants. This goes dormant during the 
winter. So I gotta cut that back. It'll come back. Um, carcoma? I don't know. I'll, if I remember, I'll put it in, insert it. But I'm gonna get the chair pulled over here. I'll be asking me to do that for a while. I didn't do my planning. I didn't go to Home Depot today, but I did do stuff. So, okay, I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> I brought this back. Like, I'm going to put that in there. I really need, like, a bucket. Like, I have several Home Depot buckets in the garage. I don't feel like going to get them. Probably not a really good thing to do with my back hurting me right now, but I'm just going to do this real quick. Don't yell Actually, at me. I think I'm going to leave it and let it compost. So that's cleaned up. I need to clean up this one over here. There's a couple of leaves. There's some dead leaves here. Shedding. I'm just gonna put it in the plant for to compost. They just start coming right off when I hit them. This thing grows amazing. I forget the name of that. Uh, what the name of that? If anybody's curious. I keep calling it a sea grape, but it's not. It's like Saloma, S Selena, I don't know. <laughs> okay, that one's cut back. I'm seeing some brown on some of these, but these are... Uh, year round as well as the hibiscus they will bloom they're closed up right now and you got more buds that will open in the morning that will those will fall off they open once fall off the next morning you get more yep have you bought another one this is a different one it's kind of peachy color for out there on the catio that he's working on right now the cats are so curious <laughs> Soon. Soon, Pixel, you can go out there. It's going to take them about a week to put it together. And again, I've already said it. <laughs> I'm way behind on the painting, Fix It Friday, Catio thing. So, you're seeing a little snippet here, but the actual Catio put it together will be probably not until January. I'm not really sure. What? I know you want to go outside, but you can't. Soon. So I wonder if those felt pad things will work on these. Because I bought chair leg things, uh, but they're too small for these. I'll try it, because see, listen to that. No. So I'm going to try that tomorrow. <laughs> I'm going to do patio, because hubby's doing the catio and the painting. So he usually takes care of the pool and the patio. I'm not taking care of the chlorine all that kind of stuff that well it makes its own chlorine but because it, it's salt water but anyway i'm not doing the chemical thing but i'll take care of the plants i think they need watered and clean up and need swept and i'll do all that since he's been working hard on all that of course cats are inspecting what i just cut all right i'm calling it quits <laughs> i mean not for me for you <laughs> I, I yeah. am filming way too much and I have way too much footage, so that's it for today. I might just start filming every other day to just try to cram it in. I don't know what I'm doing. Are you enjoying it? Let me know. Uh, but then I'll hate to miss something, like if I do some decorating or something like that. We'll see. Abby's going to jump in the freezing cold pool. She's going to take the polar plunge. Do you want to see what the temp is before you get in? No? I don't know. Ready?
cold. <laughs> no noises. No noises coming out of your mouth. Was it cold? Alright, the girls help me decorate the staircase. The, the stockings that we're not going to fill this year are covering the TV that's there. I've had these forever. Some of these were my mom's. I inherited them when she passed. And some of them are mine. They're so old and they're falling apart, but they're cute. <sighs> yeah. judge this later, but I just let them do. <laughs> it's cute. This is empty and it can go in the garage and it's not hanging out here. It was for one day. The girls uh, didn't sleep over because they had church the next morning. So uh, they did help me decorate the tree, but it didn't show because they were in their bathing suits. I didn't think that was appropriate. They didn't really want to be filmed. So I just got little tidbits. We played games. Sun joined us for one of the games. And we made the rosettes. If you want to see that video from a couple years ago, they asked to do that. It was like three years ago. I will put a link down below of how to make the rosette cookies. Um... They're like fried dough, or what do you want to call it? That dough you get at the fair? What's that called? Anyway, and then we watch Elf. They love watching that. Um, so we did that too. My, my tree needs a little more decorations. I think I need to go to Walmart to see what I can find. So there's that. We had fun. And stay tuned to the next Vlogmas because I get dressed up and go to church to see the little sing at the Christmas program at their church. So Thanks for hanging out with me today. If you're new to my channel, click my face right there and subscribe. Until next time, guys, enjoy your day.